Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. A couple of days ago, I let you know that Microsoft had confirmed that Windows 11 24H2 is now available for everyone because last year's annual update has reached the last phase of its gradual rollout. Check the video out for more info, it'll be linked. Now, although this is the case and Microsoft is making the update available for everyone, if you were running Safe Exam Browser version 3.7 or lower, Microsoft had applied a safeguard hold on your device. Because as an example, if you are still running version 23H2 and we're wanting to upgrade 24H2, then that safeguard hold had been applied because there were issues while opening the Safe Exam Browser app if you are running version 3.7 or lower of the application and you wouldn't see the update be offered to you through your Windows Update page. Now, if this was the case, then just to let you know that Microsoft has announced over on its known Issues Health Dashboard page that this issue now has been resolved. So this is another known issue now that has actually been fixed, which is good news, where Microsoft says that the issue has been resolved by installing the latest version of the Safe Exam Browser app, version 3.8 or later. I see they already are on version 3.9. So devices which are encountering this issue will need to install the latest version of the browser prior to updating to Windows 11 version 24H2. And Microsoft says that if your device still encounters the safeguard hold 48 hours after updating to the latest version of the app, you will need to contact Safe Exam Browser Support for more information on the resolution. So putting it out there, at least another known issue has been addressed. I think this will be affecting more the minority than the majority. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.